Talking about cosmetic surgery, you know, with the advancements of technology and advancements in, in the field of cosmetic surgery. For me, I feel that Filipinos are natural beauty. Um, God gave us, created us, and gave us our body. Natural beauty. It's, you're lucky if you have the beauty part. Exactly. But, but what sure. if you're just natural without the beauty? Then that's where cosmetic surgery comes in. Talula, when you wake up on a bad hair day, you don't feel right. You know, do you feel like going to work and performing your best? You don't. You take the time out to fix yourself. Yes, we go out. Sometimes there will be days that you won't feel right about yourself. But I think it's about your individual feelings about yourself, the character, the, the personal feelings that you have inside. I look at my nose, I'm not happy with it. Mm -hmm. So. I could do something about it. I did something about it. Now I feel better. I like the way I look much better than I did before. Being and living in an Asian American, it's like you're expected to be the best. Mm -hmm. So when you're expected to be the best, it goes with everything. This still falls into the place into the whole colonial mentality thing. You know, the whiter the skin, the sharper the nose, the nicer the breasts, the more <laughs> superior you are. <laughs> Now for the breasts, of course, everybody prefers a bigger breast than a flat one. Who here among the men like bigger breasts in women? <laughs> yes. I hear two people. Oh, girls here, clap if you would like bigger boots. <laughs> no matter what surgery you do you know a lot of people go in saying the distance between me and success is a new nose the distance between you and success is you it's not your nose What's so going to, under the knife is just one step higher to that and when you said about the risk everything has risk in this world driving your car in the freeway riding a plane the number one plastic surgery is the eyelid surgery number two mm -hmm. is nose job these are two surgeries that are particularly related to your ethnic traits. Well, I, I have, this has nothing, in my case, had nothing to do with cultural differences or anything like that. And so, but I said, what's wrong with getting, to, getting rid of a few wrinkles? Mm -hmm. And that's exactly what I did. I have issues with my nose as well, but I'm Filipino and I'm proud that I have the nose that I have. The conversation has revolved around beauty as something we see. And to me, beauty is something that but you that's feel. The but we cannot deny the fact that sometimes, not all the time, there are a lot of risks. Side effects. Say. It depends actually on the procedure, the, you know, the one performing the procedure. Okay. But basically nowadays, with the smaller incisions, that complication, we don't see that complication that often anymore. You can have a lot of people that have surgery, but then they're lazy about going out to the gym and improving themselves on their body or their nutrition. After 40, believe me, gravity is your enemy. Everything goes south. <laughs> Everything goes south. And so go that's down. where cosmetic surgery helps you grow old gracefully. Mm -hmm. If you love, you have to learn to love yourself. And you, when you love yourself, people respect you for that. So go by what you believe in. I like the second what you just said. That's, what, <laughs> that's the bottom line of this whole thing. Although, when I, if you're having a facelift like I did, follow instructions. Beauty is not a look, it's a feel, and it's easier, it's healthier, it's cheaper to just go that route. <laughs> what if you feel like you need to enhance what you have? To me, I look at cosmetic surgery as an enhancement, not a total change, an enhancement of what you have to start with. Just remember always that beauty, you know, is from the inside. If you are healthy enough, you have the funds, and if you will feel better about doing it, then be the best looking person as a, you can possibly be. Mm -hmm. Be heard! Stand, Stand up and speak out! out.